Yo, what is going on guys? I'm back with another video and today I am back for yet another progress episode. As always, we will be continuing the grind on the final boss title. Now, before we get into that, I do want to announce another giveaway of 25 bonds. As always, the first 5 bonds will go to the first commenter on today's video and the other 20 bonds will be split between two different winners winning 10 of these bonds each. All you have to do to enter the giveaway is make sure you are subscribed, make sure to turn on notifications, make sure to leave a like and comment your in-game name down below. The winners will be picked in just about 2 days and as always they will be announced in my community discord, in the servers discord and on my pinned comment. Links of discords are down below in the description so definitely make sure to join those. So as you can see in the chat box we just heard some 120 construction that was while just adding some Christmas paper to the Christmas cracker at the home area it got us over 104 million uh, experience which means 120 construction. We just did a duo Croesus and my man Exalted got himself the Croesus Sport Sack as a, kill, uh, as a drop kill count 408 which is an insane kill count so far so massive shout out to Exalted for doing some duos with me. Now, yeah, Mike, I got a back to back. He just got himself. Oh, back to back to back, actually. He got one before we started the duos. And um, as you can see, he got himself a Croesus Foul Torch at Kilgan 409. Uh, it just had 120 woodcutting while um, doing some more Croesus here at the Mutated Timber Fungus. And unfortunately, we didn't even get a drop for that. What is this game even? But that's also 50 Kilgan, by the way, which is halfway done. And Exalted sniping another drop here, pair of Grip Bloom Gloves, Gilkan 413, congrats man. My guy Exalted once again, his drop rate is rigged as fuck, but congratulations, he got himself another Croesus Foul Torch, that's like 4 or 5 drops in 10 kill count. It is unreal how many drops this guy gets, but he gets another scripture of big hit, Gilkan 416, congrats man. We just got ourselves a Corrupted Statues Warhammer as a drop from uh, one of the Chaos Elementals, which is unfortunately not a new collection log, but it is a rare drop, so I guess we'll take it. Hopefully we can see some more rares. Um, I'm just gonna stay here a little bit longer after I finish my Reaper Toss, because I feel like, hopefully, I might get ourselves a pet here. Damn, I think I just called this drop like crazy. I just got myself the Ribs of Chaos, which is the actual pet. I just called that a couple of minutes ago. I said I'm gonna stay hit after my Reaper task, and that was like, what, two kills ago? Just so I could get the pet, kill count 141. That is freaking beautiful. I'm so happy with that. Actually, let's go ahead and inspect this real quick. And then we have it. Ellie, the pet, has now been unlocked, which is so amazing. Let's get the hell out of here now. Damn, the Silverhawks have been coming in clutch because we just had ourselves 100 million experience in agility without actually training the skill just by using my Silverhawk boots uh, while doing some crosses. That is absolutely amazing. So that means we'll be hitting 120 very soon as well. So I'm opening up some effigies that I managed to get from Croesus and with that we finished 120 agility. Nice little milestone coming in clutch. Here we go, finishing off another Ascension Pet kill count, 135 for yourself Corrupted Ascension Signet 1, which means we just unlocked a Deep Primulus Pet. And we continue the pet hunt, but this time we got ourselves a regular Ascension Signet, number 6 as you can see right there, on my final few keys that I have for Sextus in general. So unfortunately no pet at this time, I did just do like 35 kills here. But we did get ourselves another regular uh, signet, so I'm happy with that. How does this keep happening to me? I get myself another third age juridic rope top from the giant oyster. I believe this is like my third one that I'm getting from here, which is absolutely insane. If we check out the collection log real quick, we go to clues, elite clues, we should find three third age druidic rope tops here at the, the collection log, which is insane. Here we go, we just got ourselves a drop here at uh, Legio Secundus, we got ourselves the Ascension Grips, and this is actually not a bad drop at all, because I'm going through these whatsoever, uh, like quite a lot, because I'm using range quite a lot, and you cannot really repair those, so it's always nice to get myself an additional pad, I'm actually already going to equip these, because then they will stack with all the rest of the bank, but yeah, that's beautiful, man. Not too bad, we got ourselves another drop hand, getting a spider leg top first skill of our reaper task, we take that. Here we go, nice little milestone of getting 250 KC at a wreck sword, which is uh, the end of my reaper task here, and a nice little 250 KC, quarter of a thousand that is done. 
Oh shit, my first ever blight drop. I just got myself an offhand blight crossbow on my second and final kill of my reaper task. As you can see right there, kill count 107, which is a new collection log, as well as an amazing drop, 1.9 billion. Fucking hell, I'm very excited about that. Wrong drop, but we just got ourselves another Ascension Signet, 4 from the Quartus boss. Unfortunately, not a Corrupted Signet, which is the path that I'm going for, but still can't complain whatsoever. Uh, okay, we just got ourselves another one, what is that, 3 kills later, 2 kills later? Oh, actually 4 kills later, we got ourselves another one, that's 2 Signets and 4 kills, what the hell? And on my second to last kill, I got myself another pair of, or another Ascension Signet. This time we got Ascension Signet 2 from Secundus. Unfortunately, that was my second to last key, um, key that I had, so I don't have any more opportunities to get a pet here. But another Signet, I ain't complaining. We are back with another signet, unfortunately once again it's not the corrupted signet, it's actually signet number 6 from uh, Sextus, once again, um, yeah, I, I don't know how happy I'm feeling anymore about getting these regular signets, I want the freaking corrupted ones please. And here we have another Sextus signet at kill count 238. And of course we had to follow that up with another signet at kill count 284, that is signet number 3 or 4 of the day at Sextus. You know how last time when I got Ascension Grips I said these were actually alright because I can use these? I realized as well at that point or at this point that the Ascension Grips unfortunately are the same drop rate as the actual pets, so I'm not happy with those anymore. And we just got ourselves another Ascension Signet for the last kill right before this, which was kill count 226. I don't know why, but I felt like doing some easy clues, and we just completed a total of 100 of them, which I didn't even know I was close to, and also new collection lock there, Black Plate Skirt H5, we definitely take all the new collection lock slots, so we're happy with that, plus these easy clues actually give me a ton of fortunate components, so I can't complain whatsoever with these loots. We just got another collection log update there with an amulet of magic trimmed, not too bad. Oh here we go, we just finished another skill which has 200 million experience in defense, I didn't even know I was close to that. Here we go, just got myself 150 million experience in construction while doing um, the Crosis skill here. Just finished myself another Reaper uh, assignment here at the Fight Kiln, which means we now have a total of 60 kill count at the Heart Aiken. So 60% of the way there, only 40 to go. We are getting closer to that end goal. 150 million experience in wood getting achieved while still doing Croesus. I've been here for so many kills and I'm over 30 dry, so yeah, my luck is very terrible at the moment. So apparently Croesus is really good for all my skills because I just hit myself 150 million experience and hunted as well. Might not be a Croesus drop, but at least it's a drop. We just got ourselves a spider leg top at kill count 253 while doing my reaper task at Rexor. We just hit 90 kill count at Croesus, which means only 10 kills to go and still no more drops since the last one, which was somewhere in kill count 30, I believe. Here we go, 100 million experience in divination while doing some AFKing. Just got some 50 million experience while opening some of my effigies that I managed to collect. And let's go ahead and use some of those trade away as well. We're going to put 2 in divination because that will get us 120 divination. Then we will put 2 in mining because that will get us 100 million experience in mining and 120 mining as well. And then I should have a look. So let's see another skill that we are close to a milestone. We just hit 50 million crafting so we're not going to do that. I think I'm going to put the rest in construction just because we don't want to train any more construction so let's quickly get 200 million experience out of the way so we don't have to deal with that anymore 200 million construction experience done uh, for the rest I don't think I have anything close so let's just throw them in divination because who cares about that skill Yes, we finally broke the freaking dry streak. It's a new collection log as well. It's not really that useful, but I'm happy with another drop and the new collection log. Kill count 95 as well. Very happy. A wrong signet again, but here we go. Another spare ascension signet for from Quartus. For fuck's sake, we just got ourselves another one of these stupid Quintus uh, signets or Quartus ones. I need the freaking um, corrupted Quartus and then I'll be very happy. So just put corrupted in front of that name, please. Thank you. 
Yes, there we go. Corrupted Ascension Signet for That is the path. That means we are now fully done with quarters. I never ever have to come back here. Oh my god, that makes me so happy, man. Here we go, and we hit ourselves 100 kill count at Croesus, which means I am now done with this boss for at least the foreseeable future. By the way, this is what my chest looks like with the regular loot, about 450 mil in here with the Hydrix Voltips probably taking up most of it, yeah, 200 mil, and then the Croesus Flakes also takes up half of that as well, so these are the most valuable ones, of course, and then for the rest we got some nice additional loot in here. I'm also quickly going to get myself a nice little milestone of 150 million experience in archaeology and I'm going to put the rest on divination and maybe get myself a nice middle, uh, little milestone but I'm not sure I'll get there with these um, lamps so unfortunately not 127 mil I'm actually quite far off Oh, here we go. Nice little uh, giant oyster with a blood dye. This is why you do your daily oyster, guys, because you can get things like this, which is worth quite a lot of money. And it's very nice because I'll need this uh, for my offhand crossbow. So here we go. Blood dye, offhand blind crossbow. Let's use it. And now we have the blood dye offhand crossbow, which is beautiful. Well, here we go, Ascension Grip, skill count 364 at the Ascension six, uh, Sextus, but wrong drop, and unfortunately the grips are pretty much the same drop rate, I believe, or very close to the same drop rate as the actual pad, so yeah, that's very sad. Oh, not too bad, we just got ourselves a Dormant Anima Core Helmet as a drop from uh, the Twin Furies here, skill count 293. Nice, we just got ourselves a new collection of slot at Barrows with the Carol's Coif. Okay, back to back um, new collection logs with the Arc uh, Acrise or Acrisize hood or whatever you call it. Not too bad. So Valheim is hosting his sixth year anniversary, and of course with that we drop balloons all over the game once again. And I just got myself a nice little balloon pet, which is very sick. We got the goat pet to be exact, so I'm happy with that. Oh shit, this is actually the first time that a spirit or, or a Saren spirit gives me something interesting. I got a luck of the dwarf for my Saren spirit. That's so cool. Unfortunately, not the Hazelmere Signet ring though. Nice, I just ran out of keys for Secundus or Sextus, so I can't go for the pet anymore. And I come to Quintus because I have no signets of Quintus and I have signets of any other um, boss of the uh, Legios. And the second kill I come here, I get myself an Ascension Signet 5, so that's not too bad. One more and I can finish off another Ascension Crossbow set. So let's try to get that and uh, then we can sell it because I don't need to pet from Quintus anymore. And here we go, final kill of the same inventory, we get ourselves another Ascension Signet 5, that is the crossbow set done again, never having to come back here, ever. Here we go, nice little drop coming in, Ragefire Gland, kill count 2404 at the Rune Dragons, we definitely take those. Here we go, first kill of the day at Angel of Death and we get ourselves a Imperial Core drop Well, Lunaric of course gets himself the drop but that is one member of our team so I'm very excited for him Another milestone, 70 Harakens done, 30 to go until we are finally done with Harakens and never have to do them again Let's have a look here how we are looking, 110 uncut onyxes, 98 cut onyxes, we are stacking them up once again here we go, another Legio Sextus kill with another um, Ascension Signet number 6, kill count 395, so if we go ahead and grab that up, that should be number like 10 or something. Here we go, we got the final balloon pet, which is the sheep one normally, so the balloon sheep. If we actually go to, let's have a look here, the pet storage, we go to follower, I believe it is, and we only have the ones that we unlocked. We have balloon cat, dog, goat, sheep. If we turn this off and we go down to the balloon ones, that should normally be all four balloon pets locked in, so no more popping balloons for me. Oh, didn't expect to see this, but I just got myself 150 million experience in divination as well from um, those, what did I call them, experience lamps. Yes, we are done, we are done with the freaking Sextus, kill count 457, we get the corrupted ascension signets, let's unlock Legio Sextulus, we are so happy now, god damn. Anyways, that is going to be all for today's video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe if you didn't already. Also, make sure to enter the giveaway. I'll be catching you guys in my next video, so take care and peace.